Hello there and welcome back to some more Forza Motorsport 3. Today we're continuing on the Let's Play. This is episode 43 in today's episode. We are taking a look at something different. We have moved on to the amateur events. We are now in the Manufacturers League and the first race is the Integra's Owners Meetings. Now, oh God. for that we need a Honda Integra and then I'll explain some stuff to you. So the car we're going to use today is the 2000 Honda Integra Type R. Because... Honda Integra. Uh, we'll have it in yellow because it comes in yellow. As we all Poor know, off. if it comes in yellow, that's the best colour. Mm -hmm. yeah. I could have gone white, but no well. Actually, nah, sod nah, it. Nah. I'll tell you what. While we're here. Wait, actually, while we are here, what class does this car need to be for this event? D class. Okay. Yeah, we've got a bit of room to play with. Oh god, what awful. You say awful, they're not all terrible. Some of them are. Yeah, they all are. <laughs> like, what the fuck Wings is that? <laughs> Need for speed. Fucking. Need the speed underground twee. Also, apparently you can swap different engines into it. Uh, Sure, supercharger, why not? Yeah, yeah supercharge me up. Supercharger Teggy, and because I am a nerd... We need to make this car a homage this. to the Boon, to the Poon Civic, Spoon Civic. Oh, you're so funny. I said that by accident. Anyways, um, <laughs> Integra owners meetings open to Honda and Acura Integras from all generations, including the Acura RSX. Uh, also, these ra these are now four Ooh. race series, and they're slightly longer. Twin Ring Motegi West is first. And what Six laps. Yeah, and what that means is also more money. Oh shit! And nice. more money means more ganja, and more ganja means you more lifts, so sweet. and more lifts means more money, and more money means more ganja, and more ganja means more bitches. And you see the cycle just continues, and then you turn into Pablo Escobar and get shot. <laughs> <laughs> but that's fine. God's sake, man! Get money, die trying. Do I have to go through that if all I want to do is end up shot? Can I? Is there just a quicker way? Yeah, drive a former police car around the streets of Maryland. That involves going to Maryland. I'd rather not do that. Fair play. Look at the screens in the background that aren't showing our race. Integra power! We've clearly got the best one because it's the... What's the name of this fucking engine again? Um. Um. Is it a B series? Yes. Okay then. I don't know. I can't remember if it's the B16 or the B18 though. I'm gonna have a look. Yeah, good idea. I think it's the B16. B16 boss route. That's not what I fucking want. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 it's a different sort of B16, Possibly that. Engine. Completely Integra different. Integra XSI, Honda JDMs and shit. It is a JDM type. one, if that helps. Yeah, type. A1, B16, A2, where's... I don't like this. Why? Is it a fucking B18? I think it is. Could be a B18. But yeah, you... that's... Yeah, that's what it's saying for all of them. The JDM B18C Type R found in the 96201 DC, DC2. Yeah, it's a B18. It is a DC2. And it's the best street racing engine, you know. It's the best of both. Oh, oh, fuck off. Take it up, take it slow. It says Integra twice on it, I just realised that. Well, you got to know what you're driving. It's got the red Honda badges, so got the JDM seal of approval. Oh, Jesus, don't go on about red Honda badges again, please. <laughs> I don't want them. Mm, I know you don't. My car's not a Type R. It, yeah. It's also... But it's got the K24, which is an even better platform than the B18. Yes. Same engine that Even though it gets stolen less, because... I mean, I'm People were bored in the 90s, they just robbed Integra of their engine. Well, the thing is, the B18 is a smaller engine, so it fits into more things. Yeah, that and it, it's quite potent. K24 is potent. Yeah, but it's just bigger. 
Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, oh, there we go. Going off track, going off track, <laughs> ready for the cat. I don't off. like this track, you know. What, Twin Ring Moteg? Nah, just the West Circuit. East I circuit reckon it's a beast. Wee. I've always wanted to do the fast corner of Twin Ring Motegi over and over again. Yeah, it's my favourite bit of the track. <laughs> Naturally. <laughs> Fucking hell. God, I never liked this bit. Ruins. The fact that this exists kind of ruins the entire track for me. Well, Twin Ring isn't especially interesting anyway, so... I like Twin Ring as a thing. Really? Yeah. Just because it's got the speedy bits, and then it's got mad corners. Speedy bits. Like most, like most tracks do. These are the speedy bit. Yeah, Look yeah. How most fast you go, most nearly tracks 100. have bits where you can go fast and bits where you can go slow. Yeah. Unless they're work. American. America, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Gone in here and save your motherfucking day, yeah. Yeah, nah, this car's quicker than I thought it would be. To be honest, and Inferno's joined the hangout, so that can only mean one thing. Oh boy. He's in I was going to say, he either joins or I start streaming. <laughs> <laughs> just to. Uh, I don't know. What? Is, is it not lit enough with just you and me? Oh no, it's lit enough, but it won't be lit enough once we've done like four episodes with just you and me. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> could, be, well, could be another three hours. Hello, Inferno. Some cunts. Uh, not much. Um, prophecies foretold your arrival by the fact that you joined the hangouts first. No. <laughs> How you been, dude? Yeah, it could be better. Oh, yeah. Why? What happened? Oh. <sighs> I'm drinking of, um... Monster Energy, so you know it could be worse. <sighs> well, I've played um, Black Ops Four. Hold on. We've reached car level 1! 50% discount on ignition upgrades by NGK for Acura, Honda, Highlander, Mazda, Mitsubishi, and Subaru. Why, what's up with it? Before I continue, is that a, Mu is that a 90s Mugen integral Type R? No, it's, just it's, a regular it's a regular Type R that I've dressed up like a spoon one because of course I have. Oh, to. Maple Valley Shorts well, is you, next. Well, you forgot to remove the wing. I like the wing. Yeah, the wing is the wing's the best part. Not. Hey, Inferno. Mm. I almost bought Black Ops Four on PS4 today. Ah. Uh -huh. I, I almost bought Black Ops Four on PS4 today. Right. Almost. Because it's twenty nine quid in Tesco. <laughs> okay, now. Anyways, Better than the forty five. Why are you Amazon complaining, back? anyways? What's happened? Well, uh, let's just say this. I. The last two matches I had um, on the game, <clears throat> excuse me, um, firing range. Oh, fucking bunch of camping, fucking wanking cunts. Oh, I will I tell don't you. I'm very happy. Do yourself mm. a good favour. It sounds really what? weird. Do not judge that game until you've like done gone through your first or second prestige or something because once you finally get used to it is when it actually gets fun yeah at first it's just weird because everyone has 150 health and it's fucking stupid yeah that's what they said to me about fucking I well I will say this I almost had a um, flawless match good almost but it's it a thing uh Right towards the end of the match, I didn't even realise I was uh, crouched down recovering my health next to a barrel that was on fire. Oh, you fucking special. So basically, so basically I just killed the enemy. He had obviously uh, managed to get a shot off on that uh, exploding barrel. I'm on there recovering my health and I'm like, oh, surely I can uh, go flawless. Nope. Boom. That's that's on you. That is oh. your fault, to be fair. <laughs> Quite literally is. Yeah, well, um, I've also found out why uh, the first shotgun is absolute garbage. Because yes. it's a shotgun? Because it's a pump action. Yes. Oh, not semi-automatic. 
I thought it was just because it was a shortcut. Yeah, if you want to get gold. Oh, by the way, you thanks get... for that, Emil. You could have told me the SG12 was fucking semi auto, not full auto. I did say it was semi auto. You asked if it was semi auto on stream, I said yeah. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> Why? Did you happen to go against it at some point? No, I happened to. Uh... Well, you know. Oh, be thankful you haven't had to go against it recently. Because Treyarch did a Treyarch. Oh no. Did they did they increase the range on it? No. Damage? They no, they, they nerfed it. Um to what? make to, hold on. To make the flashlight fifty percent less effective and uh, to disapprove to uh, make it so you have more aim assist. Slight issue. What? Th they made the flashlight better. <laughs> because now the flashlight blinds you more. And also stays in place for about three seconds after you do it. Fuck oh. Ow. They're not really good at this, Oh, Jesus are they? Christ. What? <laughs> you know, I'll... I just made a big mistake. You know, I'll, Jesus um, Christ. Ow. Oh. I have hurt Integ. Mm. I guess you could say well. my integrity. No, oh, fuck <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. Uh, not if this energy drink doesn't kill me first. I would stab. I mean, that pump action shotgun, it's okay. It's but fine, but you need like a bunch of attachments to make it work. Yeah, and I mean, the second attachment is longbow, which, yes, that increases the range. They don't but really do much. it doesn't really do much. And then I noticed the attachment below it is what? It's the choke, isn't it? The the choke's weird. The choke, in my opinion, makes your hip fire crosser way too small. Do you know what I find the most useful thing on that is? Mm. Rapid fire. Oh Just yeah. Because so it's a, usually yeah, a two hit shotgun, so the best thing I find to do. Does a bit quicker. Yeah, the best thing I find to do is just like hit them with one thing and then just run around for a bit, and wait for the so you can get the shot second shot shot off. Because I mm. had I did the one hit challenges in hardcore just because it that's the only place where you can really get that consistently. Yeah. But for like the blood firsts and double kills and stuff, I did that all in core just because it's easier. Yeah. And also I don't like hardcore, even though I've played more hardcore in Black Ops 4 than I have in any other game. And I still need to play because I've got a bunch of challenges that's the only completing for it. And it's also the only place where you can get Molotov cocktail kills as well. So. Because those things are spunky. That's a... Stop saying that. Why? It doesn't make sense. It does. It doesn't. Oh! What? Someone's made a wide body phase two... Phase one... Second gen for Clio and they're selling it for £1,100. £1,100. And they it. put it on Mercedes uh, wheels. You should buy it. No, it looks like shit. That's the point. You have a 40% want... discount on fuel system upgrades by AEM. This is available on Acura, Honda, Lexus, Scion, and Toyota. Fuck it, now 40%. I know. I think I've used more Hondas now than any... I don't know. Anyways, Suzuki East is next. I don't know, what manufacturer have I used the most cars from? Honda... Not Honda... Technically Honda. I've used five Hondas up to now. Mmm, yeah. But Maybe that's because you like Honda. I think it's Honda... Well, Hondas have got quite a lot of cars in this game as well. I think BMW might be up there as well. Because I've used quite a few of those. Um, I think I've used a couple of Mercedes's. Mercedes. 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 Oh, load! Won't you buy me a Mercedes Benz? My friends all drive Porsches and must make a image. <laughs> Don't like to see it like that. I have to see it like I'm gargling on testicles. Anyways. Hey, Azza. Yes? Why is your favourite Integra the Mugen Integra? <laughs> it's not. It should be, because it's hideous. It looks, it looks like shit. It does. Mm, yes. 
Oh, well. I don't like cars that look yeah, if I did, I'd have got a fucking blob eye. Fair play. Don't say that's thunder. <laughs> I say what I want, thunder. Oh. Oh, by the way, I messaged a uh, certain someone back. Oh, good. I said it's a bit too late. He said, what, what do you mean? It's like, what the fuck do you think I mean? <laughs> uh, <laughs> we done, fam. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Also, no Suzuka West yet, which is interesting. Oh, that's a shame, I like Suzuka West. Controversial opinion, I probably prefer Suzuka West to Suzuka East. Yeah, Suzuka East. Oh, sports car bed, I want it. Oh, Jesus, no you don't. <laughs> no, I don't really. But... I had one of those as a kid and I destroyed it with a sledgehammer. <laughs> well, it needed replacing and that was the best way to do it, so... Hmm. It got fucking cream pied. Cream pied. I'm picking great words here, aren't I? Yeah, yeah. Went out for dinner today as well. Did ya? Yes. I'm surprised. I had a Wagyu burger. A what? I think it's Wagyu, Wagyu. It's Japanese beef. Oh, weirdo. It's supposed to be better tasting and stuff. Did it taste better? Yeah, it was really nice, actually. It's like, it's, um... It's... What's the opposite of tough? <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, it's less tough than beef, but it's got a smoky aftertaste to it. Hmm. It also came with crispy bacon on top of it, which was nice. Fair enough. And some salad. At the bottom of it. And now it's made yeah, it's people fun. hungry, probably. You know, watching the game. The game, the game. Why do I always buy? Why do I always buy cars that have the same fucking dud fitment as? Aldi's and VW's. Does it? Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm just like, I literally don't know what stud fitment is. It's how many wheel studs your car has in the space between them. I don't know why old cars can't just be the same. Yeah, I don't know either. Mine are probably the same ish as the Supers. Actually, is the Subaru 4 lug or 5 lug? I don't remember. 5 lug. 5x100, I don't know the offset or anything. I think the Honda's 5. I hope you're wrong. I need yeah. to yeah, of course. decide with... They only, they I need to decide really whether I'm going to replace them wheels at some point or not. They only really use 4 lugs in small cars. Yeah. Uh, I think... Astra's use 4 lugs. Yeah, small car. I know because someone bought a fucking Astra just for the wheels off it and then he found out the fucking Astra's four look. <laughs> <laughs> so he had to sell this fucking Astra. It had some really cool wheels on it. They were like 18 inch T37 knockoffs that were like silver and gold. God's sake. Anyways, you have a 20% discount on driveline upgrades by the maker of Gran Turismo, Acura, Honda, Infinity, Lexus, Nissan, Scion, and Tutor. <laughs> Cars. Several. Oh, Japanese. Is it Japanese? Yes. In that yes. case, there you go. Iberian Full Circuit is the finale race. <laughs> oh, the um, yeah. That story reminds me of this picture I saw where someone someone bought a replacement door for their 206. Oh, it was yeah. Five door and they had a three door. <laughs> that was amazing. I saw that. <laughs> it was. Why would you not? Ah, look before. I don't know. Why are people stupid? Me neither. Boost fucking gay. Collection from Sheffield. Oh fuck off. It's the final countdown. What? Um, I actually read up on something. What? what did you read upon the final Interesting, yesterday. 
relating to Toyota. To Toyota. Yes, go on. Well, you know how uh, they've been basically teasing and uh, saying that all the new Super is going to be coming out at some point. In well, uh, well, apparently they've ended production of the fucking thing before even re before even releasing onto dealerships. What the super is already over? Yeah, because <laughs> they, because his thing, they <laughs> forgot to actually send them out. They actually forgot to release their own new fucking sports coupe. Nice. Wap, wap, wap. No. So, for all those hoping for the new fucking Toyota Supra, which is technically a, what, a BMW Z4 M coupe underneath. Technically pretty much. Technically, yeah. For those hoping for the new Supra, I'm sorry. It's not happening anymore. Blame Toyota. Well, it's well, probably it happening. Because you're going to have a 2JZ in it. Yeah, it's probably mm. happening. It's just not as many. Well, they're not viable or something. I have no idea. But, bro, 2JZ two, two is the best platform. Z. They can run a thousand horsepower of dark internal. Ugh. Why would, you, why would you that. run a? F if you have enough money to put a thousand horsepower through something, would you not upgrade the internals anyway? They can't run a thousand through stock internals. They actively can't. You need to upgrade it. I mean, well, they can run the like six hundred. And put a fair bit of power in because it's over design, but not a thousand. I mean, I think you put nine hundred through them, but you're still gonna have adverse effects. Obviously. Just because you can I doesn't think mean actually, it's I think actually the, it's complete bollocks. I think what I, if I, I can't remember if it was that car exactly. I think the thing with them is you can run 900 horsepower on 90% stock internals, which is impressive. But yes, you I'll do give them actually that. need to change a few bits because otherwise it will mm. just go flat. That and just because you can doesn't mean it's a good idea. Yeah, look at Jeremy Clarkson with his fucking Starion. <laughs> and his Group A Rally Car Turbo. That went really well. Until... For a lap? Yeah. And he was quicker than everything else for a lap and then had to immediately go into the pit. Oops. Has <laughs> this gone aftermarket stereo or is that just... Um, probably factory to be honest. Yeah, don't probably what? factory. I don't know why they model an aftermarket. I know it looked like they did on the Familia. Nah. Master Speed Familiar. You tease me. Oh, please me. I want I you want to be to my, be my love. To me. Oh, 1991 Mazda 121 Bubble Automatic. Oh, you touched my talala. That's fantastic! Ooh, my ding ding dong. I'm gonna get an insurance quote for it. I'm genuinely curious. Yes, it's one to one GLX Auto. How much is the car worth? Then? No. What car? Master one to one Auto GLX. GLX. It's fantastic. Aren't you going up in the world? Also, we get nothing. Oh? You get nothing! Nothing. But for all golds, we do get 11,450 credits. Excellent. Yay! And that's the end of this episode. Thank you all very much for watching. Next time, um... That's a good question. Uh... It's time for the Hyundai owners meeting. Oh, oh God! So let's show up in our best Santa Fe and we'll see you there. Thank you all very much for watching. Until next time, farewell.